Hello everybody, this is me, Leroy, coming to you live from Grenada. I finally made it here, and I'm excited to be here. Uh, class hasn't started yet. The class starts Monday, August 20th. Um, but I do have news um, to talk about. My actual flight from JFK to Grenada was uh, the worst flight of my life, hands down the worst fight ever so you know I go through security no problems um, you know I get down waiting for my flight no problems get on board you know I decide to take a little nap you know two hours later I wake up I'm still in JFK didn't leave we were supposed to leave at about three we didn't leave I don't really know why. So, you know, we're just waiting, waiting, waiting. Uh, and then the pilot gets up and he starts talking like, oh, well, we have some delays. The weather, now there's uh, a, ta a traffic jam because all the planes have to leave. And we have to refuel. And then we, uh, so then we, ref we refill or we refuel. And then we come back and the line is just as long. So then we had to refuel again. And so then we get back in line. And then we have to refuel for like a third time. And uh, we don't really leave um, JFK until uh, 10 p.m. So let's say we get, we were on the plane from about 2 p.m. And we don't actually leave JFK um, till 10. And they kept us on the plane um, all this time. We never ever got off. So uh, a lot of people became very, 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 very upset. This one particular lady was yelling uh, in the back of the plane, just crazy nonsense. Like, you gotta let us off. I need to get off this plane. Uh, uh, this is BS, BS. And um, one of my classmates was also on the plane kind of whispered to herself like oh I want to choke this bee which is okay because you know she was at row three and the lady was at row 30 you know nobody particularly heard her besides her cousin that was um behind my classmate now this woman was ghetto super ghetto and she thought it was necessary to uh, address um, the threat um, that my classmate said. So she says, hey, you're not going to choke my cousin. I'm going to choke you, B. And there was this huge argument. People were pointing, yelling, blah, blah, blah. Um, the stewards didn't do anything. They just stood there and looked. And no air marshals came out either. So it was just like a, a yelling match nobody won um, so you know things are just tensions are high people are, are upset and we're just stuck there you know like cattle um, and it was so bad um, they did feed us um, you know but I was so scared because I didn't know you know when I was gonna get off the plane I kinda just stored my food um, in my book bag because uh, I didn't know when the next time I was gonna get any food. Uh, so I had, what did I have? Uh, I had a Pop-Tart from home, um, their little cheap sandwiches that they gave me, a bag of chips, and some cookies. And I was like, I gotta make this food last because uh, I, did, I had no idea you know, when I was gonna be getting to Grenada. So, and that was, I think we got our food about, mm, probably about five hours into our eight hour wait to leave JFK. But, you know, at 10 p.m., we finally leave JFK, but uh, Grenada's airport closes at 12. So we had to fly to Trinidad, which is like a five hour flight. We fly into Trinidad at about 3 a.m. You know, we get there. We get through security and um, you know we get on the plane and then we fly out to Grenada and then I f finally set foot down in Grenada at, at about 6 a.m. 
So, you know, I don't know how many hours is that, that is, but I was traveling for about, what, from 2 p.m. up until 6 a.m. Um, and just to remind you, normally this flight, direct flight from JFK to Grenada is mm, four and a half hours. So uh, it was very, very frustrated. But um, I made it. Uh, I made it, you know, I didn't get hurt, nobody else got hurt, um, and I'm here now, ready to go to class. All right. Hey everyone, coming right back at you. Next week, August 27th, I'll be coming out with um, a new video about my first week in vet school. I'll be coming out with a video every week until the end. So, um, you know, check it out. And for all my classmates, um, I'm doing a new segment starting next week. And if anybody wants to be a part of it, let me know. Uh, we can make that happen. All right. Yeah, I was out of town.